For a long time, residents of South Lake Charles have called for improvements on Country Club Road, which is the state's responsibility. The roadway does now seem to be on the state's radar, as Teresa Schmidt explains. Growth and development is usually seen as a plus for the community. But when road capacity and development don't keep up, it creates a lot of frustration. Elisa Guillory has experienced it firsthand. If they expand the roads, which they should, they should make the lanes wider. And there should be some kind of protection for the people that live close to this road. She says there are safety issues. If you have a car going 50 plus miles an hour and it happens to leave the road, you're going to run into a business or a house. At the recent meeting of the Joint Committee on Highways and Bridges, lawmakers brought it up. I'm telling you, when you walk down that road with the traffic going down at, at certain times and hours of the day where the sun and the, and the volume of traffic, it is. It's actually very dangerous for the people walking as well as the people that are driving. Our recommendation for the area between, um, from Nelson Road West is basically a three lane section and then expanding each intersection to increase capacity at that intersection. DOTD Secretary Joe Donahue says Country Club Road has their attention. Country Club Road project is a, a project that is in the very early stages of development. Uh, it was brought up by the locals as a, a, a capacity project and some intersection improvements that they would very much like to see given the congestion on that thoroughfare. Donahue says testimony indicates there is a need for improvements. Now it's in the feasibility stage. Teresa Schmidt, 7 News. DOTD officials say current discussion is to identify possible funding sources and intersection improvements. It's not yet in the design stage, but possibilities discussed include features for pedestrians and cyclists.